academic institutions are very, as I said, you know, oh, religious institution, academic institution are similar. आप imagine कीजिए शंकराचार के पास आप जाएं और कहें कि मुझे तो करीना कपूर की पिक्चर बनानी है, so क्या रिस्पांस मिलेगा? So I think that is how academic institutions um, really were. And um, but when we uh, got this opportunity to, um, uh, I mean, Raju Hirani, who was the director of the thing, came and saw me uh, um, in Bangalore, and he said, "Can I? Uh, we've done all our recce. Can I do the shooting of uh, the idiots?" So my first reaction was, "Ye to naam bahut hi ghadiya hai. Iske saath apne institution ka naam jodenge to bahut garbad ho jayega." And so I asked them, okay, I want to hear your story. You have to narrate, just like as if I was the actor, you know. <clears throat> so I made those guys, they came with a team of four and five, and they sat down for three hours, and they narrated the story. And actually, the only reason I did it, because I felt was that this would be a great, um, um, great uh, uh, story for I am Bangalore. And this would please the alumni. That was the only thing at the top of my mind. I said, oh, you know what? This will go all over the country. Everybody will see this. His cast is very big. His director and producer are very big. So if they make this, the story is also good. So everybody will, and it's exactly what happened. I think I'm Bangalore alumni their own self-esteem and everything else got lifted tremendously because the campus was being talked about in this place. So that was uh, one part of the story. The second part of the story um, also is that it is about a book. And, and I, I, I was a little bit fortunate to have taught the author of that book also, because this book is based on Chetan Bhagat's five point something. So Chetan was my student at I.M. Ahmedabad. So um, there was a, um, um, uh, it was, there was, there was a, something very unusual, which they were trying to say at that point of time about education. It was being done in a filmy manner, so it carried a whole lot of other Ching Bang. Um, so they asked me, um, so um, when will we shoot? I said, you'll have to shoot on weekends and nights. Because in the day you have a class, so in the day it's very difficult. And they really um, uh, they stayed, the entire crew, except Karina Kapoor. And I'll come back to that story in a minute. <laughs> so uh, they all stayed on the campus, and they came and asked me, so how much do we pay for you? Now, despite everything else, I had no clue. How much should I ask? Should I ask 4 lakh rupees? Should I ask 40 lakh? Should I ask 4 crore? So I didn't understand what I was doing, what I was doing. Because whatever you do, it's going to be actually less. So I said, you know what? You will have to, for the next five years, um, help us build a program around film industry. So we built an academic um, kind of research program around film and that industry. We wrote about 10 cases. And then I said, that for the next five years, you'll have to actually do um, executive programs for film industry, and you'll have to come, which happened. And I think out of that, we made more money. And, and, and it, then it became this exercise. It was a very, because there was a lot of opposition, by the way. Academics are, are known to oppose everything that is non-standard, you know. So there was a lot of opposition. कि ये तो बकवास आदमी है, ये तो बिल्कुल घटिया बना दे रहे हैं, इंस्टिट्यूट की मान मर्यादा को ठुकरा बेकार कर दे रहे हैं, फिल्म बनवा रहे हैं, यहाँ डांस सीक्वेंस होगा, ये होगा, वो। So I had to convert this project into an academic project. So I said, you know what? This is an academic project, and I got more money than what I could have actually wrangled out of them otherwise over a period of time. But the good part was. They did lots of workshops for the students. And every evening, the entire crowd that was free would roam around the campus and engage with these students and give talks. And they would bring all kinds of people. And that's learning. But 
I'll end my um, my um, ten year, twelve yeah, my twelve year old son was very disappointed because they would shoot. The principal's house was my house where they were shooting, and so he was very admired. This twelve year old boy, and he would say, "Savere wo Amir Khan ke saath jo big group se khelega, ye hai ek." One day he kept he came back and he said, "I'm very angry." I said, "Why?" He said. Amir Khan is not able to get out of the wall, he is not able to get out of the wall. And that was it. But it was an absolutely amazing experience. I think I, I, if BHU gets an opportunity, you should grab it with some serious um, uh, producer, director. Because it, it also, um, actually, it, this happens globally. Institutions are public spaces. And I think this is a way of, of conveying who we are. Thank you. Thank you very much. So, you know, okay, so uh, Karina's story was she never stayed on campus. And she was the only one who went and stayed in Leela Palace. And, and one day the students kind of got very upset because the students were involved in this entire process and they said, what, what's, what's going on? And, and they had to be really pacified, saying, no, no, Karina is also going to come and interact with you guys. I don't know whether it happened or not happened, but she was the only, um, only odd person out in that, in that story. <laughs> it's normally very difficult after a splendid speech to have an anticlimax, and I hope I, I will not do an anticlimax. Since it's a movie, I also feel like giving the vote of thanks in the language of movie because when I heard his speech, I was reminded of the movie A Beautiful Mind, where you know the Russell Crowe who is acting as John Nash comes to the class and dumps a book in the dustbin. So here is a vice chancellor who is saying that five years of university education is a waste. So. Um, and it also reminds, of, reminds me of Bernard Shaw, who said, if I can, I teach. If I can, I do. If I can't, I teach. So uh, seldom we see, we, we hear about polymaths, but today I think on my personal behalf, I should thank Professor Chandra to have come all the way here, because to me, he seems to be a true polymath. And uh, in the language of Khalil Gibran, who said the definition of time, the definition of coal, time's definition of coal is diamond. No wonder from the mining engineering such diamonds are indeed produced. So thank you, Professor Chandra, for having come here all the way to address us. Uh, my thanks and deepest regards to Sri Shekhar Sharan for having presided over this session and engaged the audience for their question answer sessions. Thank you, Professor Sharma, for having um, organized this lecture series, and Professor Tripathi for having joined and given us the last missing piece of information, a vital piece of information. Thanks to all the uh, student coordinators who have helped uh, a lot in putting this program in place. Thanks to all the participants who have had an active engagement with this. Thanks to all. Thank you very much.